On this day back in 1944, Franklin Roosevelt announced that he would run for a fourth term as president of the United States. So he would go on to win the election, but died two months and 23 days into his term. So he's the longest serving president in the U.S. And our list, though, this morning, we'll look at the other side of history and share the presidents that actually spent the shortest time in office. So at, at number five, we have Gerald Ford at 895 days. He served from August 1974 to January of 1977. Number four, Warren G. Harding, 881 days in office from March of 1921 to August of 1923. He died two years and four months into his term. All right, number three, Zachary Taylor at 492 days. So he was in office from March 1849 to July 1850. He died one year and four months into his term. And at number two, uh, Garfield, I know I was thinking about this about this earlier. He served from March of 1881 to September of 1881, dying only six months and 15 days into his term. And number one on the list of shortest presidencies, William Henry Harrison, 31 Ooh. days. He was in office That's only from line. March to April in 1841. He died just about a month into his term. He got sick of pneumonia mm. and passed away.